Hi, I'm Dave Filippelli. I'm a Chancellor's Professor of Earth Sciences in the School of Science. Um, and my project is getting the lead out, community solutions to environmental health problems. Now, a lot of people understand that lead poisoning is a uh, crippling many communities around the country and indeed around the world. Lead poisoning comes from the exposure of largely children to uh, lead in soil or dust or uh, even in tap water. And those kids, once exposed, are always impacted. So lead poisoning has a, has a long time impact on the individuals as well as the communities that host those individuals. Because those, those kids will grow up to be young adults who will have learning difficulties and usually poor educational outcomes and other behavioral issues. So, uh, lead poisoning has become a big focus of a lot of community conversations, but unfortunately we know very little about where the sources of lead are in communities uh, beyond generalizations. So my project involves a very tight partnership with a couple local groups here in Indianapolis to help train the next generation of uh, budding environmental health scientists to uh, actually go out in communities, talk to people, sample homes and soils and empty lots uh, and return the samples to our lab where we basically simply provide a technical service as well as training for that for the youth some of the things we've seen have been pretty incredible so the youth gain agency in their own community and confidence obviously from learning the science but also learning how to translate that science but probably more importantly is that they've provided us the researchers with new techniques and tips for more effective research translation and more effective community engagement, to tell you the truth. And they've also provided some solutions that uh, we couldn't have uh, derived ourselves. I'll just provide one example, is when the youth heard me talking about the concerns I have about unlicensed daycares being big exposure risks for some communities. They uh, went to these daycares and rather than saying, hey, we want to test your soil, knowing that they're unlicensed for a reason and, uh, and they wouldn't be open to that. They simply said, hey, if, if we uh, brought a bunch of landscaping material, could we landscape your playground? And they, of course, all said yes. And so what the students did is, without necessarily even knowing the conditions there, they, uh, they contracted for a free delivery of mulch and planting materials. And they uh, mulch all of these playgrounds and landscape them. Uh, and when you do that, you actually seal off that lead layer, uh, the lead soil from kids' exposures in the first place. So whether the problem was there or not to start with is definitely gone afterwards. So really creative ways that I've learned uh, that engaging youth in, uh, in community uh, appropriate reactions can be really, really effective. So as you can see, the translation has actually gone both ways for me.